everybody, I'm Steve and welcome back to Vortex the Gateway. I played this a couple of months ago when it first came out on Early Access. And I left it because there wasn't really a lot of things in it to do. But now it's been released full very soon, scarily soon. So I booted up the other day and it ran really slowly. And, um, and it was just terrible so I wrote a review on it. An honest review saying that I thought it came out so too early but... The developers sent me a message and asked me to reconsider my review, so let's see what it's like. Let's do the story mode. Welcome to the eternal loading screen. This can take up to one to five minutes. Never takes one minute. At least you've got plenty of time this time to read all of these on the screen. Usually in games, they don't give you enough time to read them, but you can read them all. Again and again and again and again. And more if you want. If you like the soundtrack as well, then this... This rolling screen is a good time for you to record it. Wow, that was fast. Hey, Alex. Hi. I'm over here. I was not expecting you to regain your consciousness at all, Alex. Why, well, what happened? Coma for two days. Wow. Good to see you. Good to be back, uh, Mike. Woo! I can jump high. What happened? Whee! I'll tell you what I know. Woo! But first, you need to eat. Gravity and drink. is different than jumping hey, here's to fire. Some food. Oh, I can't jump on your head. Eat it. <laughs> <laughs> so the mic's head. Okay, it is running a bit easy. better, but I haven't put it on maximum this time. I've just put it on high because this is a spare I was getting barely 30 frames per second. Now follow me to get something to drink. Wait, follow me. Let's go get something to drink. Let's go get something to drink. Lucky, there's some water fruit for something to drink. Two Look days. at that. And I have terrifying news. That is cool. That we is are not on Earth. Dun, Just dun, look dun. At that flaming planet. Okay. It's frightening. A lot of odd uh, things have happened that way, Mike. these two days. Have you hit your head? Vortexes have appeared in the sky. In almost every the voice acting isn't necessarily here. bad, but it's a rope probably. Shelter. And it's cut badly. If something attacks, use it. Uh oh. What is happening? You just run, Alex. Run. Where did you run to? Oh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I love the way he ran to a predetermined position. Where the hell is Mike? Just so it'd be able to pick him up. Would you where the hell is Mike? You just saw him. I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. I you to an iron to my work all day. I need bamboo to build my hut. And I'm without a lady. That is a cool planet. Why would I need a battery? Maybe there's a lot more stuff added to this game than I thought. So this is a story mode, so I've got to try and escape from the island. I don't know how long it is or how I'm going to escape, but can I not build like the turrets anymore or anything? I used to have to build huts, but maybe I can't anymore. Let's build a fence. Um, how do we do it? Oh, there we go. Yay! We need more bamboo. I might do a few episodes on this story mode just to see how far it goes. And I may rechange my opinion of the game. I mean, I still think it was taken out of early access way too soon. It seems very basic. Saying that though, like Resident Evil 1 was first released. The voice acting in that was terrible. So, <laughs> maybe I can't judge a game on just acting. Oh, I can hear a dog pig. I wonder if they're still called pig dogs. Or dog hogs. I can't remember what they were called. There we go. I, <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be protected much from that. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Squeely, squeely pig. I don't know what I need to do. It's still need to build a shelter. But at the moment, all I can build is a fence. And a gate for the said fence. Well, are you going to fall? Thank <laughs> Thank you. Oh, there he is in the background. Hi! I'll just leave him alone. Oh, I'm going to end up killing him in a minute. He's screaming in my ear like that. Right, I'm going to keep bit collecting some bamboo, keep collecting some supplies, and then we can see if we can build another better shelter than just this one bit of fence. It does perform a lot better than it did. Well, I'm going to reserve judgment until I finish making my hut 
and seeing whether the story elements there are in the game. Start off with a basic shelter at first, and then I'll just build upon it. Just so I've got somewhere. Full, I can't pick up another. Just so I've got somewhere safe to go if there's any monsters come at night time. I think I just make it three by three. Oh, hang on. Where did all this come from? Where did all these come from? Where are these on this side? I didn't see these before. How do we build this? You need 24 bamboo, 6 leaves. I've got 10 of those. I just need some bamboo. Oh, well, if I knew that... Okay, I put the house here, just in front of my fence. There we go. Oh, will you shut up? Honestly. Shush. Oh, I'm sorry, but you were doing my head in. I like the fact that you can place the blueprints down. So you can see where you are. Okay, we just need a few more bits of bamboo. Oh good, I'm glad we've got the house. And now I can find my way back home because the house is on my radar. Good, goody goody gumdrops. Oh good, I found some more bamboo near my house. Is there a way that I can increase my stamina? Because I'm running out of stamina real flipping fast. What is that noise? Ooh, what are you? Look at that! That noise you make does not suit the way you look, mate. You look kind of like a crustacean, so it means that at least there's water near here, which I knew already. <laughs> I just wanted to make myself sound smart. What are you? Man, there's so many weird creatures here. I, that better be you making that noise. Cause that does not sound safe. The harmless creatures sound like blimmin' killable creatures, then I don't know, I don't want to know what the baddie ones sound like. Okay, we should have enough bamboo now to finish off the house. Oh, this is good. So I can place all my blueprints down, and then just get all the materials for it. Oh, I like that. I like that, so I can see how it's going to look before it's finished, so I can do any design tweaks that I want. Okay, you're going to build the fence up around here as well. I might... Build it out a bit more as well, so that I've got more room for. So I've got more room for other things, like maybe another shelter or something. I don't know. There might be some more. I have a feeling there might be some more survivors around since this is the story mode, and not the survival mode. I suppose I can always edit it in the future. As long as it's safe for me during this night that's coming up, then it's okay. Okay, I, I just... I'll make sure it's secure and safe for me. And then I'll start thinking about other people. Because at the moment, there are no other people. Well, there was Mike, but... He's been abducted. How did I get the other ones? Boom. So look, I think you're getting the picture. It's going to be a very, very, very small garden indeed. As long as I'm safe, I don't really care. Boom. There we go. Can I pick all of you up? Go. Because I'm a fire starter. A twisted fire starter. Can I eat? My ribs now, please. Yes. There we go. Hopefully my stamina should fill up more now I've just eaten. So yeah, this, this game, okay, it's not as... Now it's been updated and the frame rates are a bit more playable because I don't want to sound pretentious. I don't want to sound like I expect too much from a game. But when you've got a machine like mine and you can't run a game under above 30 frames per second or even above 25 frames per second, it's a bit frustrating. And it just... Like, not even arcs that bad anymore. And it just makes you not want to play it. I'm not, I, I don't want to sound like I'm spoiled or anything. But if it runs this badly on my machine, which is a really good computer, then I don't want to know what it would run like on... What is this? A spider. That is a big backside. Baby got back. I don't want to know what it runs like on other machines. But it's running all right on mine. It, you know, it's... It's not dropping below 50, but it's not going above 60, really. As I said, that it got to 47. <laughs> That's okay. It's a bit more playable now. And it is an enjoyable game. Obviously, it's very similar to all other survival games out there. 
and the the animals look more like they're floating as a part to, as opposed to actually walking on the floor. And I'm yet to see any enemies, which is a good thing. Don't get me wrong. But it'll be interesting to see how this story mode fleshes out. And see if it's actually worth playing. Yeah, I think we're nearly there. I think we've nearly got enough to finish off my little house. To protect me from the ghosts in the night. I hear bad things and it's dark now, so I'm a bit scared. My hands are full. I can't pick up another. Oh, it's just that, I think. I think it's just that snail looking thing there. Hopefully, we've got enough bamboo another. to finish my shelter off. My hands are full. I can't pick up okay, another. Okay, I get it. Your hands are full. You can't pick up another. I don't like it. Damn it. Is you, are you making that noise again? Come here. Whoa. Are you going to blow up? I thought it was going to blow up then. What did I do with it? Ah. One bug was picked up. I wonder if these bugs have names. Well, they probably do have names, all these creatures. I don't know what they're called. The only thing I remember is like the dog hog or something like that. And it sounds like this guy's just seen them and just named them himself. That's a dog looking thing that sounds like a pig. Dog hog! Oh, you stupid pig! Always making me jump and squealing in my ear. Oh, was it just a worm bug? Oh, for crying out loud. I feel so stupid now. Oh, will you come back here? Come back here. Come back here. I need your living flesh. They are too blimmin' noisy for their own good. Honestly, who runs around squealing like that? It's like they're on constant panic mode. Yay! <laughs> I'm just barely in the room. Oh, I can't even get in my house. I've made the gate too close. <laughs> there we go. I've got to jump over it. Can I close it? Please? I have to do parkour every time I want to go to bed. How do I... How do I dismantle? I don't, I suppose I'll just park on it. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. The woes of a beginning pl beginner player of a game. What is that? That's one of those birds that kills you, but it's run away. Good. Is it flanking me? Yep. Ow. It was flanking me, this sly little burger. Yeah, you better run away. Very lucky I don't fancy chicken. Come back here. Come back here. Come back here. Yes. Screw you. <laughs> You're dead. Business. Oh, not another one of those pig dogs. Ugh. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, it's just you. These things are just going to... Be the death of me. Oh, great. There's loads of them. Oh, they're so blimmin' annoying. All I can hear in them creeping around. Man, I need some food and drink fast. Well, look, we finished the house. Got some spare bamboo back here. Look at it, it's good. The only problem is, <laughs> is that I opened the gate, I can't actually get in. So we've got to parkour it. What is that? Is that attacking me? It is! Oh. Ugh. Go away, you stupid thing. Come back here. Gotcha, you son of a gun. Yeah, so it's not too much of a pain in the backside having to jump up here. But we'll get it sorted when we uh, play a bit more. Oh, stupid pig. Right, ribs are cooking. Where's the water gone? When Matt got abducted. Shut up. Thank you. Man, they're so noisy. Right, well, I'm going to leave this video here. 
This, I've made a house, I've got a bamboo saw, I've got a bow and arrow, which I don't think I'm going to use because it's, look at this. <laughs> it's so bad. It's so bad. It's things like that. Like, that can just be vastly improved. That could be vastly, vastly improved before they release the game. I stand by what I said about this game being released way too soon, but it's alright. I will do more videos on it. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Whether you think it's whether you agree with you think it's released too soon, I understand that games are hard to make. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to smile, because you are the face of the Stable Place games. Bye-bye! <laughs>